Hi y'all, welcome back out to the range with me and what I've got, I've got the T-Sauce 1911 Stingray chambered in the 9mm, I got it back on the range today and what I'm going to do, I've done made one video on the unboxing, I went into details talking about this, totally designed around concealed carry T-Sauce is made. Uh, I made one video on the functionality of, the, of this little pistol and today what I'm going to do, I'm going to put 80 rounds of defensive, different kinds of defensive ammo through it to see if it is reliable for EDC. And guys, if you want to stay with me, I've got four different types of uh, defensive ammo I want to run through it. And what I'm going to do first is I'm going to run the critical defense 9mm Luger 115 grain FTX. I'm going to run two magazines of that through it. I'm going to do one and see if we can get it on on target, take my time and get it on target. And the second mag I'm gonna run, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a mag dump with it and see what it does that way, functionality wise. And guys, we're gonna check this thing out and see if it is reliable for EDC. And if y'all wanna stick around, we'll see how it goes. And uh, leave me a comment and tell me what y'all think of the T-Sauce 1911 Stingray, and uh, guys, that being said, let's put some on target. This time, I'm going to just see if I can get on steel and see how I can shoot with it, and then we'll do a mag dump with the same ammo. Let's see what we can do right here, guys. First mag done pretty good, pretty good. Guys, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna put the second round, second magazine in there, and we're gonna do a mag dump on it. I'm not gonna necessarily go for accuracy. I'm just gonna see how well it would do if we feed them through it fast as possible. So here we go, guys. Alrighty, there's our first critical defense. Done real good, Hornaday, 115 grains. Guys, what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna use the Winchester Silver Tip 9 millimeter Luger. We're gonna put it in there, it's 147 grains. We're gonna load up two mags, do the same thing with it. And uh, just stay right there with me. Okay, y'all, we uh, done the Hornaday critical defense right there. On the first round, 115 grain FTX. And we done a mag dump. We done just uh, tuck our time and see if we can get it on steel. Like I said, this time we're going to do the Winchester silver tip. And this is 147 grain. Got the silver tip on it. Going to do the same thing. We're going to put the first mag on steel. And then we're going to do a mag dump with it. It's going to be an expensive test, but I want to check it for reliability. So far, it's done good. Everything about it's done good, guys. And let's put some of this on steel, and then we'll do some mag dump. See what we got right here now. So far, so good. Now we got the same thing, mag number two. We're gonna do some mag dump on it. See how it goes. Get our earplugs back in good and tight. We're just gonna see how well it feeds them fast right here, guys. All right, let's do her. All righty, there you go. We've done been through two different kinds of defensive ammo. What we're going to do next, we're going to do the Federal Personal Defense, 124 grain, the punch right there. Guys, I'm going to get two mags that loaded up. We're going to do the same thing. Got two more to go. Hang in there with me. Leave me a comment and tell me what you think. If this te test is out to be pretty good, I'm going to start and put it in my EDC lineup right there and start carrying it some, guys. Hang right there and let me get two more mags lined. Okay, guys. Defensive ammo 
test round number two, or number three, excuse me, we got the Federal Personal Defense, the punch, 124 grain, nine millimeter. Gonna do the same thing. We're gonna put the first mag on steel, take our time with it. And then we're gonna do a mag dump on the second mag, just like we have been. And guys, y'all let me know what you think about this right here. So far, this little pistol handles good, feels good. You can get a good sight picture. And this makes, after today, this will make about 300 rounds I'll put through it. It's run flawless so far. And guys, let's do her. Let's do her. Let's take our time and see if we can get her on steel. Alrighty. Mag number one of the punch. Guys, you know what's up next. It's dump time. We're gonna dump her. Alrighty, locked and loaded. Just gonna dump it out and see. <laughs> Tell you what. T-Sauce has really done a good job on this, I believe. I believe it's gonna be a reliable reliable little carry pistol guys what we're going to do is final our last one will be the sig sire elite defense uh nine millimeter luger 124 grain jhp get two mags that lined up loaded up and uh i'll be right back with you tell me what you think leave a comment and if you like this kind of content subscribe to the channel give me a thumbs up be right back two more mags in there okay y'all I got us two more mags lined up, loaded up. Right here we got. Got us two more, We're going to do the same thing. Sig Sire Elite Defense right there, V-Crown. 124 grain JHP. Going to do the same thing. Going to put the first one on steel. Then we're going to do a mag dump. It's been an expensive little test right there, but it's I believe it's worth the time to check it out and make sure it's going to be uh, reliable for a DDC, and I believe it's going to be. Like I said, I've shot a bunch of rounds to it so far, and uh, I really, really like the feel of it, and I really like the way it shoots. And guys, that being said, let's quit jacking our jaw, and let's do it again. Y'all ready? Let's do it. There we go. Let's get us one more in our final mag right there, guys. 80 rounds of defensive ammo. Tell you what, defensive ammo ain't cheap these days. But that this right here will make us 80 rounds that we put through it. And we're going to do a mag dump this time. All right, hang on. Guys, I tell you what, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Look at that thing. It's emptied out, cleared, there's nothing in it, but I want you to look at that. I mean, just a beautiful, beautiful pistol. I mean, it just, it's just nice. At least it's made good, got a good, good safety on it. I mean, it's just all around nice little pistol. Good safety, good sight picture. I don't know what else we can do. I mean, I've done run a bunch of ammo and defensive ammo and like to fit and finish and the feel of it. And I just tell you, I just tell you, it's a nice little pistol. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this kind of content. And if you did and you're not subscribed to the channel, subscribe to the channel. Give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment and tell me what you think about it. And guys, remember one thing. The God that created the heavens and earth loved you so much that he sent his son to die for me and you so we could have forgiveness of our sins because we couldn't do it. We were lost and undone without him. And he died on the cross, shed his blood, and on the third day was resurrected from the dead so that me and you could have eternal life. And if we repent of our sins and confess, according to the word, confess Lord Jesus and believe in our heart that God raised him from the dead, you shall be saved. And so we can enjoy this life, get out on the range and enjoy shooting and enjoy your family and what God's created and allowed us to have. And we also could have eternal life. 
until the next time stay strong stay, stay tough and guys can get out and vote this coming november and we can ch maybe change things politically wise until the next time may god bless you